Hello children, today we are going to see 7th class science, 15th lesson, soil, our life, question answers. Let's start. Through your learning, first one, how can you say soil is a precious resource? Give reasons. Answer, soil is a precious resource. It is the basis for growth of plants. Third point, it is habitat for microorganisms, animals, reptiles, etc. Soil is used for various purposes. Almost all the things in our surroundings, directly or indirectly, depend on soil. Okay, this is the first answer. Next one. Second one, which type of soil is suitable for growing cotton? Answer, black soil is suitable for growing cotton. Black soil is sticky in nature. It retains water for a long time. This soil is suitable for the growth of cotton, sugarcane and paddy. Next one, give reasons for low percolation rate in clay soil as compared to sandy soil. Answer. Water passing down through the soil particles is called percolation. If the proportion of fine articles is more, then the soil is clay. If the proportion of larger size particles is more, the soil is sandy. As the sandy soil contains large size particles than clay, the percolation rate of clay soil is low as compared to. Okay, this is third one. Next fourth answer. Fourth one. Why is top soil more useful for us? Answer. The top organic layer of soil made up mostly of leaf litter and humus decomposed organic matter this layer is soft and porous it contains nutrients which help in the growth of plants top soil is capable of retaining water in it it is a good habitat this is one word habitat for many living organisms Fifth one, what types of soils are there in our village? Make a list of crops grown in, on those soils. Okay, actually, this points have to be written by your own. But for example, here I am giving some points. Okay. Answer. Types of soil differ from village to village. For guidance, a village in Warangal. Rural district is identified and details are given here. There is a black soil in the village. This soil can retain water for a long time. Here, farmers grow cotton, sugarcane and paddy. Sixth one, Ravi wants to improve water holding capacity of his sandy soil field. What would you suggest to him? Answer, in sandy soil, the proportion of larger sized particle is more. This soil will have more percolation rate. If a good proportion of fine particles are added to the sandy soil, these fine particles hold the water. So, Ravi is advised to mix clay soil having fine particles with the sandy soil to improve water holding capacity. Okay, this is sixth one. Seventh one. Do you think rotting vegetation and animal remains are important for the soil? In what way? Answer. Rotting vegetation and animal remains make up the humus rich in fertility. 
दे कंटेन न्यूट्रियस नैचुरल मैन्योर विच गिव गुड सपोर्ट टू द ग्रोथ ऑफ द प्लान्स एट वन रूट्स ऑफ ग्रासेस होल्ड सॉइल पार्टिकल्स दिस कंजर्व द डैश सॉइल विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स इज करेक्ट करेक्ट द रॉन्ग वन सॉइल फॉर्म फ्रॉम सॉइल फॉर्म फ्रॉम सैंड दिस इज रॉन्ग वन ओके वॉट इज द करेक्ट वन सॉइल इज formed slowly as rock erodes into tiny pieces you can see here the answer here okay soil is formed slowly as rock erodes into tiny pieces near the earth surface okay second one crop rotation predicts soil fertility yes that is correct answer okay statement is correct third one clay soil can't hold water for a long time this is wrong statement so what is the correct statement clay soil contains more fine particles so its water holding capacity is more next one upper layers of soil are made of rocks this statement is wrong the upper layers of soil is made up of humus mixed with mineral particles okay next the tenth one collect soil from your school ground try to make a ring with that soil write down your observations what type of soil is it <clears throat> excuse me answer the student can do it the soil changes from school to school so the student with the help of the teacher can make the observations okay so this one you have to do it by yourself okay whatever soil you get in your school you try with that soil okay 11th one take a boiling tube put two spoons of soil in it heat it on a spirit lamp and cover it do this experiment and write your findings do you find any moisture in the soil from where it came answer this soil is found to contain minerals like salts of sodium calcium and magnesium traces of potassium chlorides sulfates and carbonates are also observed b do you find any moisture in the soil yes i found moisture in the soil c from where it came it came from the following situations as the boiling tube is covered on the bottom of the cover water drops condensed are found due to heat the moisture in the soil got evaporated and the vapors were condensed on the bottom of the cover Okay, this is eleventh one. Next twelfth one. Nazmal's grandmother said, "Human beings always depend on soil." Is she correct? How do you support her statement? Answer: Nazmal's grandmother is correct. I support her statement. Soil is one of the most important natural resources. It supports the existence of living organisms third point we use soil for different purposes in our daily life almost all things in our surroundings directly or indirectly depend on soil fourth point the soil supports all plants animals and microorganisms we grow our food components in this soil 13th one if you sow a seed in the soil it will give birth to a tiny plant which grows bigger and bigger it is the wonder of soil swetha said how do you express your appreciation of soil like swetha answer 
soil always support plants to grow it is plants that grow lifelong soil supplies the necessary water and nutrients to the plant throughout its life period the plant makes its its own food using solar energy and the gases in the atmosphere with the help of water supplier by the end it is one of the wonderful things we observe in the nature okay next 14th one write a dialogue between seed and soil to perform a small play using your own script okay own script you can write but for example i am showing something here you can even write these or you uh, make some changes and write this okay soil who are you seed i am a seed soil what do you want from me seed i want water minerals and nutrients soil why do you need all those things seed as i want to germinate and become a big tree i need all those things soil definitely i will supply all that things needed to you to become a big tree okay this is 14th one next we'll see 15th one if you have a chance to talk with soil scientist what questions would you like to ask him about soil i shall ask the following questions how can you test the soil for its acidity is it possible to change the basic nature of the soil how can water holding capacity of the soil can be increased soil be increased at a low cost this one suggest methods to improve the fertility of the soil what can be done with the black cotton soil when a building is to be constructed as black cotton soil yields and the building cracks suggest preventive measures for it okay this is the 15th one you can even frame your own questions for 15th one okay last one do you find any relationship between the chapters soil and nutrition in nutrition plants what are they answer plants get their nutrition from the soil where they grow all plants cannot grow in every soil we should to oh, sorry we have to select plants to seed suited to the soil available by taking proper steps we can improve the quality of soil for a good growth of the plants so this is 16th one so that's all for today we have completed all the question answers okay in the next video we'll see the next lesson question answers till then bye bye have a nice day